Trying to decide what plane I should fly today. What do you guys think? Maybe we go with the FW190, the giant beast? Yeah, let's fly. Before we do, let us know in the comments, should we do a collection video? We've never done an RC plane collection video. And if this video gets 2,000 likes, we will. Boy, I feel like I could just land it on that path. That was good. Sure, that looked good. I'll just keep going around. I think he's nervous. <laughs> Looks so good, always. <laughs> I just had to do that for a second. <laughs> you will hit the like button. <laughs> I am nowhere near as nervous for this takeoff as I was. Maybe I should be. But that balsa plane we recently P47 tore the Thunderbolt. Ooh, baby. <laughs> I needed some foam safe in my life. Are you ready? Yep. Here we go. Uh, let's do, we'll do half flaps, yeah? Sure, those are crazy nah. flaps. Nah, we'll wait, we'll wait. They're split flaps, they look so good. Okay, let's take off. Taking off usually is not the problem. <laughs> I'll tell you when to do your retracts. We'll do those retracts. Those, those landing gear look so like big when they're hanging down on this thing. Now what you don't want to do on a warbird is wingtip stall. So I'm going to try to keep some speed up through those banks. But I'm excited to be out here today flying this, Okay, guys. three, two, one, go. They're so slow. Oh, but they're pretty. It, it is, yeah. That was nice, wasn't it? Yeah. Okay, uh, this feels so good. <laughs> <laughs> I just remember the last time I flew this, I struggled to make the landings very pretty. Otherwise, I uh, really have enjoyed putting this in the air. It's just such a big, beautiful airplane and just rock solid too. Here we go. Let's get it in low and fast. Full throttle. Beautiful. If that's not just the best warbird pass you've ever seen, <laughs> I don't know. I'm, I'm watching the wrong guys. I'm doing it wrong. That was nice. Oh, it's not very often I like can brag about myself. That's a really pretty bird. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Here's what everybody wants to see. Whoops. Safe off. Let's do some maneuvers. Got to shake the enemies or are we chasing somebody down? I don't know, there's someone on our tail, Abby. I gotta lose them. <laughs> one of these days, I'll get you on a warbird up there with me, a big giant one, and we'll fly them together oh my gosh, that'll and be shoot each other down. Ja, 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 ja. I think a big warbird it might be scarier than a success jet. I don't know, I, I, I don't know. I've got so much like stick time on uh, warbirds. I feel pretty good about them. I always get nervous flying them. I'm trying to keep it pretty scale today, guys. Who saw that jet up there thousands of miles, or feet, thousands of feet up there behind me? We'll go this way, roll it to the left. <gasps> Just breaking all the comfort zones. And with safe off, I actually needed a little bit of trim. I'm not sure if it's just because it's been a while since I've flown it or I didn't trim it up the last time I flew it. We'll keep it a little bit on the scale side here. Yes. Still, still rolling to the right, just a hair. Not bad though, very flyable. Uh, since I've turned safe off, it's remained off. Use a little rudder on that bank and that'll really clean it up some. And I do actually have a little bit of climb in this, so. What are you looking at for your flight time? Uh, you know what, we'll shoot for maybe like four minutes. This is a big bird, so. You wanna go ahead and put the landing gear down? And then I've got another battery. We'll get another battery in here. Uh, do it on the other side, let's. Okay, that sounds good. Scary coming in at you, huh? Mm -hmm. Big thing. So just for, I don't know, fun, I guess, I turned safe on right there. And then we will turn around, put the landing gear down on this pass, and we'll do a flyby with the landing gear down. When Abby says go, that's when we'll <laughs> do it. And then I'll try to get a nice clean landing. Okay, go. Okay. Boy, I feel like I could just land it on that path. That was good. Sure, that looked good. I'll just keep going around. We should be fine, I hope. Um, and then we have a fresh battery. We'll put another pack in. For those of you guys that are like me and could just drool over this stuff all day long, we'll get another flight in. 
Maybe I'll throw possibly an inverted pass. Think I could handle it? <laughs> I don't know. I can't remember what I did on the last one, but ooh, that I feel like I should have landed it on that landing gear good. down pass. It was good. It was so beautiful. Let's just kick those flaps on and use them to our advantage. You saw the climb. That's because I could use a little mixing. What we don't want to do here is stall. So we come in under some power. Baby. That might be the, and then what oh, happens with this plane every time, every time on the asphalt, the twist. it really just is so hard to keep straight. But I'll tell you what, the challenge for this video was to bring this in as clean as possible on the good. next landing from our next battery. Maybe I'll do a couple practice landings. I will remember it's, it's hang, hanging to the right when it comes down. So if, if I give it full left rudder, maybe we can counter that. Let's see if we can clean that up but I'm ready to put a, f a fresh battery in. Remember, 2,000 likes, and we're gonna show you guys an entire RC plane collection video. Let us know in the comments if you wanna hit see it. Hit the like button. <laughs> you must hit the like you button. You will watch this video. <laughs> Nate thinks that's a German accent, but he sounds like a vampire. <laughs> <laughs> it is. I will watch this airplane. <laughs> This is where it gets good, you guys. I want to fly your plane. <laughs> Why haven't you hit the like button yet? <laughs> I think my German accent, my German vampire accent is better than your... I wasn't trying to do an oh, accent. Oh, okay. All right, or, here we go. I don't know. Maybe I was. I'm just not going to admit to it. Boy, the takeoffs on this are just so nice. Some planes just torque so hard, especially warbirds uh, on the ground when they're taking off. It's not very pretty, but this one is. It's not bad. And landing gear. Let's sit on the other side. Yeah. Other side, okay. We'll just keep it down. Yep. Doing a dirty pass, as they say. Stunk. Sounds like, yeah, I did. Whew, stinky. <laughs> That's so weird. I don't I don't like that phraseology. Some some phraseology in our hobby or in aviation I feel like could maybe be updated a little bit. Maybe a little bit. <laughs> All right. Three. We'll line it up. Three, two, one, go. Oh, I'm slow, so. I was doing a pretty slow pass. Okay. I'm gonna turn safe off after this bank. Guys, who out there has ever turned safe off in a bank? That's scary. I wouldn't do that. Anyone that uh, has ever done that knows what I'm talking about. Don't do it. <laughs> Their safe is off. I still need to trim some of that climb out of here, but a tiny bit of up is better than a lot of down. <laughs> okay, this is one of my buddy Gary's favorite passes. He does that, three quarter roll, and then banks it out of it. That was a little on the sloppy side, but you do like a three quarter roll and then you do your bank. So rather than doing like a traditional bank, we'll do the traditional bank on this side, right? So there's your bank, a little bit of rudder, a little bit of elevator. There we go. There's our normal bank. What, uh, and I've done this a lot too through the years, but I think Gary has said multiple times is one of his favorite turns. What we do is we climb it a hair, roll it right, even though we're turning left. Again, it could have been a little cleaner. I'll do it one more time. That's there. Gary from I Just Got Here right. YouTube channel. He's my buddy. All right, let's roll it left. We'll roll it right. We don't lose a lot of uh, pitch on this when we roll it, which is really nice. A lot of times, warbirds, you have to angle up quite a bit and then go into that roll because you're going to lose some elevation when you come out of it. But this one's not bad at all. Actually, I don't know why I haven't been flying this one more, you guys. It's really crazy. I think because the landings, you probably the landings got discouraged. The are a little bit scary. There we go. That was a little cleaner. Did you like that? That was nice, that was right? Good. That was good and smooth. Give it a low pass this way. It oh, looks low good. pass this mm -hmm. way. Okay. We're going to come in at a funny angle, bank it in this way. And that's not very low because I didn't want to, mm -hmm. you know, risk it. But we'll bring it around this way. Fancy right hand turn. Yeah, that's right. Nice and low, aggressive aggressive banking just kind of like warbird flying and I'll try to get it in low and fast on this side you're right it does look good doesn't it <laughs> kick that yeah do up. that sooner okay I will. <laughs> <laughs> 
Uh, Anybody... You were talking about an inverted pass. Uh, I was I talking want... about it, wasn't I? <laughs> I don't want you to get distracted. I was talking it. about it. You have like it. a minute left. <laughs> Let's see if I can clean up that really pretty pass that you were talking about. Oh, I, I see. Roll that wing I up see. I side. see what you're doing. Everybody uh, at home knows what you're doing too. What? I'm just avoiding this. <laughs> Let's go for it. Right about now. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Oh. Yeah, that hillside scares you, doesn't it? Is it? Depth Inverted perception. pass. Let's see what we can do. I'll do it this way. Get her leveled out. It wasn't my idea to it begin with. I'm just idea. making I'm sure just, you stick to I'm a little what high, so are. see how she flies inverted. Oh, I thought you were talking about a low pass. I said inverted pass. No one said anything about altitude, <laughs> high, low. All right. No one said anything. We got to keep that throttle up. I just anybody it up else a see high. that speck up there? Right, let's see what I can do. Believe it or not, this All is right, you're at four. All right, now we're going to climb out of this outside loop. Oh, boy. It actually did it. It actually okay. pulled that Landing off. gear. Landing gear? What? You're going to land? It's Keep four it minutes. Oh, okay, all right. I like safe on with this for the landing. Can so let's put see? that landing gear down uh, as we come in for the actual landing with no flaps oh, on this. Man. Make sure you can see I'll it. I'll make sure, yeah. We're looking for two pretty huge landing gear. Yeah, gears. they're giant. So coming down, if I can't see them, we won't touch down. No flaps on this time. I see both wheels. Okay, so it jerks to, to the right, you yeah, said. Well, I can't remember now if I need right rudder or... You said left. Okay. Oh man, that was a bounce. It's fast, go, go, go. Let's go around. <laughs> Good call, good call. But I, I was actually zero throttle right when you said go, thinking <laughs> I'm going to bring it in. But you know what? That little bounce let's, said. Let's hope the battery life lasts because you're at like yeah, five we're, minutes. We're good, we're good. I'll let you guys. We have telemetry too. We're good. Okay, I couldn't I'll remember let you know if this one had this it. Flight, what the voltage is on. I was and, trying to remember yeah. how old this plane was. Yeah, this one actually was one of the first ones, I think, to have that okay. telemetry. So what do you guys think? When you come in for landing, do you like a high dive landing like that? I mean, you really have a lot of speed you got to bleed off when you do that. Come on. Ah, oh, come on, man. And there, there's, that's, that's my, oh, what? I did. I did too much rudder. I did, you did. I countered it, but I did too <laughs> much rudder. But that's actually really encouraging to know mm -hmm. that that can be that was your best uh, landing, cleaned I think, up. This. Wow. I really wish I had another battery to try a few more <laughs> landings, but whoa, <laughs> that was pretty good. That was pretty good. Nobody says it was bad. <laughs> That was a good landing. No trolls in the comments will tell me it was bad. So awesome. I remembered as I was turning my radio off that I was gonna check the voltage for you guys. Now, the downside is actually when you unplug your battery and then plug it back in, it's not quite as accurate a reading as right after a flight, so if I plugged it in to tell you the voltage, it just wouldn't be as accurate. So you I don't apologize. have your smart battery check. I don't have it on me, yeah. no, because I knew it had telemetry. So I didn't really feel the need to bring that. But what do you think? I think that's an improvement of the last oh, yeah. time we've seen it on the channel, especially if flying this. The last time I flew, I know I was a big old nervous Nelly, but now I feel really <laughs> good about nervous it. Nervous Nate. Oh yeah, no, my <laughs> name's Nate. <laughs> I was a nervous Nate. Uh, but now I feel really good flying this, taking off, all that. And actually landing this is a cinch uh, compared to some other things I've flown this year. So this just went up in cool points like a lot for me. I, I don't remember my final like impressions of this the last time it was on the channel. It's been a while. It's been a while. I don't know. I've just let this collect a little dust and fly other things. But I seriously like this way more now than me just looking at it in my collection. So... I don't know what that means for you guys, but for me, that's that's really good. <laughs> I'm pretty happy. And for this experience, this day, getting out here, I don't have a coat on, there's no wind. It's like 65 degrees. Oh my gosh, even this shirt that I've got on is a little too hot for today. Thank you, God, for this beautiful day to get out here and share this hobby and experience with you guys. Thank you. Pretty happy right now, pretty happy. I've got a little adrenaline going. I'm just pumped. Um, also, a massive thanks to our Patreon supporters. Oh. Abby actually works really, really hard on all of our social media, so it would mean a lot if you guys enjoy Instagram or whatever your thing is. They're all in our description box, so give us a follow, give us a like. Remember, if this hits 2,000 likes this video, we're going to show you our entire RC plane collection, or at least like 99% of it. So smash that like button, hit subscribe. We'll see you guys in another video. Again, a massive thanks to God and our Patreon supporters. 
and we'll see you in whatever awesome video we have popping up right about now. Thanks for watching. We'll see you there. Bye.